after an 11 day layoff for both teams for finals. Both George Mason and Bucknell are back in action this evening at Soika Pavilion in Lewisburg upon this year. Cecilia Collins kicks it out. Marley Wall's gonna try a right wing three and bury it. Good start for Marley Walls, gets the offensive foul on one end, knocks down a three-pointer on the other. Top of the arc, driving a kick, Johnson right wing three, knocks it down. Bucknell two for two from beyond the arc on their first two possessions, a six-nothing lead of Scranton. In the free throw line, O'Brien sinks it on the run. Taylor O'Brien's got her first two. Gonna run the break, gets to the basket, lefty scoop, no good, offensive rebound, Emma Schaefer, and she gets the putback. 10-0 Bucknell, timeout, George Mason. 7.47 left to go in the first. Bucknell, 4-5 from the floor. Here's Cecilia Collins, an open look for three. And Collins knocks it down with eight to shoot. Looks to attack the basket. Gets some space and uses the glass. Bucket good for Walls. She's up to five points. Sisselman, step back. Three on the way is good. Remy Sisselman. Knocks down the fourth three-pointer for the Bison in the opening quarter. It's a 19-10 lead. Drenchel, shot clock to game clock. Sisselman outside for three, rattles it home. Six points for Remy Sisselman. If doesn't use it, instead drives in. Skip pass outside, Walls for three, swish. Marley Walls up to eight points here in the first half. It's gonna swirl home for Jamison, instead it didn't. Here's Walls driving righty layup, good. Marley Walls in double figures already in the first half. 10 points for her to lead the way, 29-15 Bucknell. Sisselman gives to Kershaw, looks to attack, splits the defense and gets the finish. Carly Kershaw started 0 for 4 from the floor in the first quarter, picks up her first two here in the second. On a backdoor cut, closed out well by George Mason. Now inside of Marley Walls, inside for Emma Schaefer and the bucket good. And direct traffic gives to Collins at the free throw line. Cecilia drives up with the bucket and gets fouled. And to the free throw line to try to complete a three-point play, Cecilia Collins. The right side walls, now Collins inside Kershaw, and she gets the bucket off the glass. Kershaw up to five points in the game, 46-34. An assist for Cecilia Collins, her third. Gives to Johnson outside. Back into Kershaw, running for Collins, cutting to the basket. Circular motion for Cecilia Collins. Back out there for the Bison. They find her right side. Catch and shoot three, it's good. Kalesia buries her first of the night. Bucknell up 51-38 on the George Mason Patriots with three minutes left to go in the third quarter. In the corner, double team, dump it inside. Kershaw backing Scott down inside, up with a tough hook shot. Off the glass, back inside, Kershaw. Curling, spin move, off the glass and good. Kershaw's up to nine. Kick out to Walls, extra pass, O'Brien shoots the three and swishes it. O'Brien, right corner three, buries it. Taylor O'Brien with 11 to the right. Sisselman, a straightaway three on the way, it's good! Remy Sisselman is up to 13 points, a breakout game for the freshman from Long Island. On the break, a two on one, flips it for O'Brien, looks to drive inside, O'Brien gets the runner. 13 points for Taylor O'Brien, 72 to 60, Bucknell up by 12. Mason aggressively pressing. Karshall nearly traveled up ahead. Here's O'Brien waiting underneath. Gets the bucket and the foul with 23.1 seconds left. Taylor O'Brien makes it a 10-point game, and that'll do it. The Bucknell Bison victorious over the George Mason Patriots tonight by a final score of 77-67 to here at Soika Pavilion.